Alright, this phrasal verb talking about takeout, and I was just thinking about the, um, you know, all the uses, as I always do for these phrasal verbs, how many uses. This one has a lot, and that's awesome, so you got to learn them all. Uh, someone could say, you know, let's say that there's garbage in your house, you don't have a maid, so there's these bags of garbage, and you need to take them out of the house, you need to pick them up, get them out, because you don't want the garbage sitting around in your house, or sometimes you call it the trash, so you have the garbage bags. Take them out. Can somebody take out the garbage, or did you take out the garbage today, or sorry guys, I forgot to take out the garbage, so you didn't take it out. It's a common way of using it. Next one is something like batteries. Batteries. Okay, so I've got a remote control here, and let's say uh, that it's not working. So I can't turn the TV on and I'm saying maybe I gotta get some new batteries for the thing, for the remote, so I, could, so I gotta take out the batteries. So right now I'm taking the batteries out of the remote control. So if you have something that may be broken and you need to take something out of it, like a part out of a computer, you are taking it out of the computer. So something's inside, you take it out. Um, so it's pretty, pretty easy there. Um, let's say I'm writing a sentence and I ask a friend, you know, maybe I'm writing a book and I ask my friend, I say, hey, uh, what do you think of this? What do you think of this sentence here? And someone could say, you know, it's not bad, but I would suggest taking out that word because I don't think it's a very nice word. So it's removing the word. I'm deleting it. I'm taking the word out. So, you know, I'm like some, I could say, for example, someone might say, oh, I don't like the battery example, you could take that out of the lesson. So I'm just removing it from the lesson if I wanted to remove it. So just to explain what I mean there. Um, next one, let's say you got a cute little puppy dog, right? And your dog is, your dog wants to get some exercise and your dog needs to leave the house. So you could take your dog out for a walk. So we can say, what are you doing? You got the dog, you're like, I'm just taking my dog out for a walk. So you take your dog out, okay, take him out of the house. Maybe the dog has to use the bathroom, right? Take the dog out, take the pet out. Take your girl, who's not a dog, of course, on a date, right? I, I could say, so my, my friend could call me up and say, yo, uh, what are you up to this weekend? What are you doing? And I could say, or what are you doing tonight? I could say, uh, sorry, man, I got to take my girlfriend out uh, to a fancy restaurant for dinner because it's our anniversary, so I'm taking her out on a date. Um, I could take her out for a walk, but that's, you know, well, I could do that, but she's not a dog. Um, so if you take them out, it's like you, you pay for them and you take them on a date. That's taking someone out. Um, and then the last one, uh, let's say I'm being a lazy pig and I'm just thinking, you know, pretty hungry right now and I don't want to cook anything. I'm thinking pizza, and I'm, I got my phone out and I call for delivery. I'm calling for takeout. Someone could say, do you want to cook tonight? And I go, nah, I'm way too lazy and I'm hungry. Let's just watch TV and get takeout. So if you get takeout, you call for delivery and someone makes the food, a restaurant, they bring it to your house, that's getting takeout. So you can get takeout, you can take your girlfriend on a date, take your dog for a walk, Take your dog out for a walk. Uh, take, remove a word from a sentence, or remove a sentence, or remove an idea, something like that. Physically take batteries out, or a computer part, or take out the trash. Take garbage bags out of the house. Gotta get rid of them. So, that's how to use takeout.